Hey, what's happening, guys? This strange clown suitcase is the Big Clown Internet of Things kit. And this, I believe, is their Deluxe Extra kit. With the actually very nice little circus-styled suitcase. So, Big Clown is a Czechoslovakian company, I believe. And uh, they sent me this kit. And we're going to take a look at what's inside of it today. We're not going to make anything today because I have to install all the software and everything. But I wanted to to get this out and show it to you guys. And uh, I think it's kind of interesting. So let's open it up here. These are just some cards that say, thank you. And this gives you a little bit of information about some of the different stuff. Sigfox integration. And some links where you can get information and the files you need. Now there is a ton of stuff in here. So I'm going to sort it out and then we're going to take it out and have a look. Okay, first of all, one of the nice things that they include are some 3D printed enclosures. This one I believe is called the, the mini enclosure. You see how that goes on like that. These are very nicely 3D printed. And they come with some O-rings that fit. Oh, you get the idea. They fit over there. My fingers just aren't cooperating this morning. Then here is a larger enclosure. Really nice. And then this is the biggest one of all. And you can see it has the LED module installed in it already. And it's already <clears throat> set up here. We've got all sorts of sensors. We've got some beautiful stuff installed here. And we will be taking a look at that here very soon. But I want to get through everything that we have going on first. See, this is a complete module ready to roll. Now, if you're going to call yourself Big Clown, well, you better enclose a clown nose, right? All right, so the first thing we're going to find here is the USB dongle. You can see it there, and uh, that's how it communicates with the system comes with the shell pieces. You can snap it all together. And after that is the core module. Now this is the core module. And if we can zoom in here, If we guys would be able to see that, it is a uh, ARM Cortex M0 processor on there. It's got Wi Fi, Bluetooth, built in sub gigahertz radio. I mean, it is just chock full USB uh, interface on there. And you can see it has stacking headers, which are very nice. It makes it easy to uh, put your project projects together using this system. And we'll go into that. See, here's a, a sensor module. There's a button module with a nice clickable button. And this, this is formatted. <laughs> I had to pick one that doesn't want to fall right out of the bag, didn't I? 
Well, that's the beauty of live videos. So here's the button module. You can see very nice clicky tactile button. And then here is this little mini thing. And this is made to fit right in there for your modules. A lot of nice design engineering went into building this. So like I said, there's the button module. That one is a PIR module. We have a climate module. A flood detector. Very nice. A relay. A mini battery module. Then we have just a mini cover and the full size cover. And remember, I told you this one is already pre built. We're going to look at that in a minute. But this is what's in it right now barometer, temperature, a battery module, core module, a lux meter, humidity and an LCD module. So let me get this guy ready to roll. Okay, so here we have this all set up and it's running. You can see it's showing us two things on this nice little reverse LCD screen, temperature and humidity. And that's page one of four. If we press the button, we go to page two. Uh, CO2 is not showing up. We're getting 540 some lux from the uh, light sensor. And if I bring in some more light, you can see how that goes way up. Very nice. We have pressure and altitude. I'm not sure if that altitude's right. One of you guys can calculate this in your head. I'm at about 900 feet. And it's showing the battery of 0 0.01 volts and 0%. Let's see what the other button does here. Oh, that's it just scrolls forward and backwards. So if we take this off here and we pop this module out, that's that LCD module. Now inside of here, you can see these little sensors which are what are known as the tags. Then we can also pop off these O-rings here. Maybe. There we go. And take this nice big case apart and you can see how the entire thing is stacked together. So there we have our lux meter tag, our humidity tag, our temperature and barometer. Yeah, this is a very nice system. This is the battery board. It takes uh, AAA batteries. And I haven't had time. This just came yesterday. And like I said, I wanted to make sure that we got a chance to, to talk about this. It has that built-in sub-gigahertz radio, so it's probably transmitting this information out there somewhere. I just don't know where to look for it yet, but we'll figure that out because, like I said, there's so much more we're going to do with this in the future. It is uh, programmable through its own interface using Node-RED, and uh, it programs through... Uh, a web interface. Yeah, it's very nice. Wirelessly. Everything is designed very well. And it just boom, it just plugs together. Once you've got everything set up, and you power it up, Boom. 
Very nice. So, this is just an introduction to the big clown IoT things. I, uh, I see big things coming for big clown in the future. Right now, they're small. I'm not sure what their uh, total production output is. So right now, these kits are a little pricey. I'll put a link down below if you guys want to go check it out. But if you're looking for a single solution for something that you can put together and deploy, this is pretty cool. And I'm sure as they uh, ramp up their production, their production costs will go down. This will become more reasonable. So I want to thank Big Clown for uh, sending this kit out to us. And like I said, there's going to definitely be more. And I want to thank you guys for watching, commenting, and subscribing. Big thanks to all the patrons. It's Sunday. Go do Sunday stuff. I'll see you guys later. That's it. I'm out. Peace.